Okay, today I'm going to be changing the uh, sump. Everyone's told me, nightmare, just take the engine out. It's too old, all the butts are rubbed, all the bolts are rusted rotten. So, Ivy Co. would normally just take the bolt and plate off, which is, uh, I'll show you just now. This is a 50C17 X Police. So, about a month back, I got a hole in my sump. I put some metal weld in there, but it's still got a little weep. I'm not sure if it's coming from there, because that stuff's pretty good, but it needs changed. It's got a couple of holes in here, I can't run like this. So, in theory, these big bolts here have got to come out, okay? These two bolts here, and that big bolt there. These are easy enough. This is 22 mils in here. 22 there. Uh, put a spanner in here. Rattle gun on here. This has got to come off. This is probably all corroded. But uh, yeah. And it's the only way you can drop the sump out. Might have to take the other side off to get this arm. That's here. This torsion bar out the road. What's well, not a torsion bar? It's that roll bar. So I think it is anyway. So yeah. And uh, when we get these out, these bolts, these four bolts, and this off, this here, you swing this out the road. This piece here swings out the road. It allows that to drop down because it won't drop down without that swinging out the road. It doesn't happen because it can't come down. So this needs to come out around the road. Or this this piece here doesn't go by. If you're looking at there, it won't go by. But if you take that bit off, you'll see there's a gap around here. That needs to swing out the road to make that make that happen. So that's today's mission. I've not seen him to do one. Everyone told me it's a nightmare. You'll regret trying to do it. Take the engine out, it's easier. I don't think so, not in this van. It's too old. And uh, there'll be more problems taking the engine out than anything else. The engine's not done a lot of miles, only 60,000. But uh, that's the problem with her, she's been left to rust and rot a wee bit. And, uh, but hey, I've done a lot of work on this. I've had it for three, nearly three and a half years, nearly four. And uh, shook me up, spent a lot of money on it. All the drivetrain is nearly all new. Uh, as in prop shafts, bearings, rear wheels, everything. So this is a this is a big job. If I can get the end of the year out of this, uh, I'll be happy. So, yeah, uh, she's done my well. She earns the money. So as I say, it's a 50C17. It's big, it's heavy. It runs at 5.2. I'm running 4.2 empty all the time. My stuff on it, tools, joiner. So yeah, that doesn't really daunt me too much. It's just uh, everyone telling me, everyone telling me what was wrong with it makes it daunting. But uh, the job itself, I took one off a scrap vehicle the other day there, and pretty easy. This is basically the old one, uh, not my old one, the old one I took off a scrap vehicle, just to see how it was done. Seems easy enough, so I'll give you a wee update how it's going. Cheers.